All right. The time for sports. My host here with that. My little hockey preview for you, Hudson. Dallas Stars sniper Jamie Benn scored his first NHL goal against the Vancouver Canucks. Can his former Kelowna Rockets teammate follow suit? Well, points aside, it is going to be a memorable night for the island's own Tyson Berry. The young defenseman is making his first appearance at Rogers Arena tonight as his Colorado Avalanche face off against those Canucks. Tyson Berry has been to many hockey games at Rogers Arena, but this is different. You know, it's an electric building and, uh, you know, I'm excited to, you know, play in front of my friends and family. Barry's first shift in Vancouver comes in his fourth NHL game. He was called up February 4th from the Lake Erie Monsters after leading all AHL rookie defensemen in scoring. It's been, you know, a bit of an adjustment, but let's try and, you know, play my game a little, little offensive, but uh, we haven't had too many power plays here in the last few games, but, uh, you know, definitely just being aware defensively, not taking any reckless chances and, uh, you know, being, being able to be relied on. At five foot ten. Barry has relied upon his speed, skill, and a solid shot for success. These qualities helped him lead his Kelowna Rockets to within one win of the Memorial Cup Championship in 2009, found him a spot on the junior national team in 2011, and now a job on Colorado's blue line. So far, he's been responsible defensively. His down low coverage has been pretty good, and uh, that's, that's going to be the challenge for any young defenseman when they come into this league, especially a guy that may be a little bit smaller in stature, but uh, no, I, I've liked his game so far. Having strapping defenseman and fellow Victoria native Ryan O'Byrne on the team has helped make the transition easier. You know, he's a confident kid and, um, you know, what, he knows what he's doing. So yeah. give him little pointers here and there and be, be positive with him. But, you know, what, he's, uh, he's a good player. It's the other OB that Barry is developing a special bond with. Shane O'Brien is his defensive partner and has taken the rookie under his wing. Yeah, Shane, Shane's a beauty. Yeah, he's always joking around, so you know, makes things a little lighter. I just sit in the locker room before the game and just listen to him. I can't stop laughing. He's going to be a great player. He's just got to learn the little details of playing your own end, and that comes with just playing games and getting experience. And uh, you know, most importantly, you know, the boys here like him. He comes up and you know, he, he's respectful and um, he realizes it's, it's an honor and a privilege to play in the NHL. And um, he's got his head on straight, and he's, he's going to be a good one. But the biggest Barry boosters will be in the stands tonight. Close to 20 friends and family will watch him in action, including his father, Len. The former NHL player and real estate developer has been supporting his son every step of the way. You know, my dad was actually my coach all through uh, minor hockey, so, uh, I mean, he's been the, uh, you know, biggest influence on me. He's pushed me to, you know, be my best, and, you know, if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be here. So, uh, definitely for him, obviously, my mom, and then, you know, we've had some good uh, assistant coaches, too. Vic Gervais, my trainer, so uh, you know, there's been a lot of people to, you know, contribute to. I'm cheering for Tyson Berry tonight. Yeah, me too. Very nice young man. I wish him all the best. So. Yeah, my thank you. You're welcome.